welcome back to my YouTube channel. So as you can probably tell from where I'm starting this little vlog today, it's basically just going to be a little vlog. So basically today, me and my family are off to London for the day. We're basically just going to drive into central London because it's basically a Sunday. So there's not really going to be that much traffic about probably. So we thought we'd drive in, save, get in the train or anything like that. So yeah, we're just going to drive into central London today. And I thought I'd bring you along with me. So come to London with us, guys. And just before we go quickly, I thought I'd quickly show you what I'm wearing as I normally do. So yeah, so today I'm just wearing a um, black roll neck jumper. This one's actually from Oasis. It's a couple of years old now, but I mean, it's still going quite strong. So yeah, I've just got a um, black roll neck jumper on from Oasis. And then I've just got a long sleeve black top on underneath it, just because, I mean, it's absolutely freezing out in London lately, so I mean, best to keep warm and all that, isn't it? But yeah, other than that, I've literally just paired it with some black Topshop Jamie jeans. I mean, obviously they're Jamie jeans. I mean, I don't really tend to wear anything else these days. And then on my feet, I've literally just paired them with some um, black Stuart Wiseman boots. I mean, it's absolutely freezing out, like I said. So, I mean, I've got to keep my feet warm. So, yeah, that's literally all I'm wearing today. I'm probably going to put a hat and a scarf on because, like I said, it's absolutely freezing. I'm dying to get cold or anything like that. But, yeah, that's all I'm wearing today, guys. So, come to London not with us. Literally just arrived at London and we've just parked in um, Tower Car Park I think it's called but yeah so we are just gonna try and find out how to get out of this car park but yeah so like I said we have just parked in Tower Hill Car Park I think we're gonna go and try and walk towards like Catherine Dock kind of area but yeah so not entirely sure but I'll show you when we get there so we have actually made our way out of Tower Hill Car Park now finally but yeah literally as you come straight out of the uh, car park it literally it takes you right by the um, Tower of London and right looking over so I'll quickly show you the view now. So this is literally of the view right by the Tower of London. Obviously you've got the Shard right in the background. And then as you come round, you've got the tower right about there. But yeah, and, and I don't know if you can actually probably see, I think you probably can, but there's like lion statues over there. And a fun fact for this, obviously I did listen in history, slightly in school. There actually used to be real lions in here, but yeah. So this is just a view of the tent, really, really cute. And the sun is shining, which is obviously really, really nice. Oh yeah, and mum just said there's a bee theater giving a talk down there. You can actually have a tour in there if you want to, but obviously you have to pay for that. But yeah, this is just a view other than that. still walking down towards Catherine Dock. I don't know if you can really see behind me, but there is Tower Bridge up. I know you've probably just seen that like little lip of like round by the tent and then Tower Bridge in the background. But yeah, we're just by like the water fountain a bit now. But yeah, we're gonna start heading down still towards Catherine Dock. Obviously it's a Sunday, so we're not in really any kind of rush to kind of get down there. But yeah, we're just taking a nice little stroll along the Thames as a little family on a Sunday. One of our robbers is actually at home hungover, but I mean, there's four of us that have come out for a little stroll. I think we're going to go and try and grab a drink somewhere as well in a minute, because it is getting on a bit now. But yeah, we just come out for a little bit of a Sunday morning and a stroll. Really, it's a family, but yeah, so we're just going along the Thames now. It's really, really nice. The sun is absolutely beaming down. It's a little bit chilly. It's not overly cold, but the sun is actually really, really nice. But yeah, so we're just heading towards the Catherine Dock right about now. just arrived at um, St Catherine's Dock. I think we're gonna go and try and grab a drink in one of the like, um, either like pubs or like restaurant type things, because inside of like the dock, there's all like different restaurants and bars and bits and these is all inside really, just around the outside of like all the boats and that. But yeah, we're just gonna go and quickly try and grab a drink. I think we're gonna get a hot drink, as I said, because it was absolutely freezing. But yeah, so we've literally just arrived at St Catherine's Dock and I will show you where we get a drink. So we did actually 
actually just got today drinking Cafe Rouge. I mean, it was actually quite like busy around us, so I didn't actually like film I was in there. It's literally just behind us and right there. So yeah, we had a little drink. I didn't actually end up getting a hot drink like a couple of us, gonna. But yeah, purely because when we sat down in the sun, it was actually like so much warmer than I thought it was gonna be. So I wasn't actually that cold at all. So I was like, I don't really fancy a hot drink now because I'm not actually not, not even cold. But yeah, sorry if you aren't actually here because we are actually walking towards the um, River Thames now. But yeah, obviously, like it's a little bit more windy now because obviously we're coming to the train. But yeah, so I actually just got a lemonade. I think my brother got a Coke and my dad got tea and my mum got a cappuccino, didn't you? It was very, very nice, but yeah, so it was actually really, really nice. But yeah, we're just gonna start heading back out and coming stop. So we have actually walked back along the Thames. Obviously, you can probably see it's in the background. We are just heading back to the car now. It's basically just like a little Sunday morning walk along for us. But yeah, so we went and had a coffee and that. But now we're going to head home and have a family Sunday dinner. Because obviously it is Sunday. I know that the day you're probably watching this is probably Wednesday. But I mean, the day we've actually gone was Sunday, as you can probably tell. But yeah, we're just going to quickly head back home and go and cook roast dinner for tonight, really. But yeah, so come and see what the family roast dinner looks like. Hi guys, so I am actually home now. I mean, do excuse my hair because obviously I've had, had a hat on. So I've obviously got a bit of hat hair. But like I said, I am actually home now. I think my mum's literally just putting the roast dinner on, so probably not going to be ready until tonight. But yeah, so I am actually back from London. It was actually really nice just having a little walk along like the um, Thames and that. Yeah, I think I'm literally just going to quickly tidy up my room a little bit soon. This is a little bit messy from like where I was in a rush this morning from going to yeah, I think I'm going to quickly do that. And then I don't really know, probably just chill for a bit before the roast dinner tonight. But yeah, I'll show you the roast dinner when it's ready, guys. So, like I said, guys, I am actually in the middle of like tidying up my room. But is it weird that I put the... Um, like the stuffing back in boots and back in the boxes once I've worn them. I mean, my brother just come in and was like taking the mic and saying, oh my God, that's so weird, what are you doing? But I don't know, I've just put all like the stuffing back in the boots just to make sure that they kind of keep their shape. Maybe it is me, maybe it's a bit weird. But I mean, at least they're going to keep their shape and they're not going to like, I don't know, the leather's not going to tear or anything like that. So yeah, if you haven't already asked, I am still tidying up my room. I've shut the curtains, which is probably why it's a little bit dark in here, but I mean, Basically, I changed out my jeans and I've just put some joggers on, but I've still got my jumper on just because, I mean, it's a lot more comfy just to sit in drawers in joggers, really. But yeah, I am still tidying my room, so do excuse the mess that is behind me because, like I said, I haven't actually finished it. I just basically put my boots away that I was wearing earlier. But yeah, I'm also one of them people that gets distracted really easily when trying to tidy their room. I like to tidy up my room, like, when I said to you I was going to, but I mean, I just get distracted so easy, like, when I'm doing it. So, like, either music's playing and then I go on there and then my phone goes off. Oh, my God, literally, it's a bit of drama. It's not that much of a drama, really. I'm just exaggerating just a little bit. But, yeah, so I am still tidying my room, but I'll check in with you guys again once it is finished. Hi, guys. So, it's actually probably quite a little bit later now since I last spoke to you. So, I've actually tidied up my room quite a bit now. So, it's looking a lot better than it was. Let's just say that for the least. But, yeah, do still excuse my hair because, I mean, where I've had hat on, it's literally just got really hot here. I need to wash tomorrow, really. Yeah, it's literally just gone half one now, so I've literally got like 20 odd minutes until I need to put my Sunday video live. It has uploaded, I just need to press publish once it hits five o'clock. Yeah, like I say, I am filming this on a Sunday, but obviously you will be seeing this on Wednesday, so I do really hope you're all having an amazing Wednesday, but literally, I'm so excited for this roast dinner. It literally looks so, so good, especially after walking around London like this morning for a little bit. I mean, we didn't really walk that far, but I mean, we still went for like quite a little bit of a walk, as you probably saw. I guess I have actually worked up quite a bit of an appetite so I'm so so looking forward to this roast tonight and it smells so good I'll quickly show you what it looks like as it's cooking but yes I don't really know if you're gonna be able to see but I think there's like roast potatoes in there excuse like my um jogging bottoms I've changed out of my jeans and put joggers on as you can tell I've got some fluffy socks on to keep my feet warm but other than that we've got potatoes cooking in there I think that's beef probably and then we've got some veg that's probably gonna go on soon but yeah, like I said, I think my mum said it's going to be ready for about five, half five. So I mean, we haven't got that long to wait, which is quite good. So we're having it quite early tonight. Because I mean, normally when we have a roast dinner on Sunday, we have it at lunchtime. Unless we go to, like out of the morning, like on like a walk or something like that, like we did today. Then obviously we normally have it in the evening. Just because I mean, Sunday's obviously meant to be for a roast dinner. Yeah, like I said, it does smell really, really good. And I'm literally so excited about having it. But before dinner, I do need to push my video live at five. As you can probably tell right about now, my hair is like doing its own thing, just looks super, super flat. No matter what I do with it, it's just 
basically tomorrow I just need to wash it because I wore a hat today and my makeup is literally melting off of my face as we speak it's so like oily now that it just basically needs to come off but yeah so dinner was really really good I literally am so so full I think that's probably the last clip that you saw but yeah dinner was absolutely amazing I thoroughly enjoyed it there was a lot of like carby food there and I mean I'm all for that to be honest with you I literally absolutely love it but yeah it was so so good I've done so many potatoes basically because she like didn't realize that we didn't really have any parsnips in so she done literally loads and loads and loads of potatoes which was so so good I literally thoroughly enjoyed it I'm not gonna lie but yeah and she also did like gluten free dairy free Yorkshire puddings all those basically homemade ones because if you was wondering what they actually were on my plate they're basically just homemade Yorkshire puddings but obviously they're gluten dairy free because I mean I'm just not allowed gluten and I'm lactose intolerant so that's basically why my mum makes her own ones just so that I can kind of still have some but they was absolutely amazing I literally I love a roast dinner it's literally my all time favourite dinner I just honestly I live for roast dinners they are amazing but yeah I actually had chicken I didn't have beef mum done chicken and beef but I mean I just really wasn't feeling that much beef to be honest with you so I just had chicken as you probably saw but yeah today has been super super tiring I know we didn't actually walk around London that much to be honest with you but I literally feel like my roasting I literally is just like I don't know it's just made me like not like even more tired but I mean I'm literally just gonna sit in chill watch a load of absolute trash Sunday night TV because I mean what else am I going to do and then yeah I'm just going to probably go and take my makeup and go to sleep really but, but I do really hope you enjoyed coming around London for the day with me I mean I say for the day it was literally just the morning struggle along like the um, Thames to St Catherine talking back again but, but I mean it was pretty good at none of the less and I did thoroughly enjoy it I mean at least like I kind of like built up a little bit of an appetite for like my full Sunday dinner but, I mean it was really good especially because it was like a little bit sunny I mean I know it was cold when we was walking but when we was like sitting down having like a drink at Cafe Rouge where we was actually sitting it was literally right in direct sunlight as I probably said earlier but yeah it was actually really warm just sitting there and it's quite nice to be honest with you just having a little drink there sitting out looking at all like the yachts and that but no it wasn't really really good but yeah, I do really hope you enjoyed this vlog guys sorry it's a little bit random like we're not in London all day long but then you come home you kind of see a little bit more of my home life I mean not there's really that much going on at home but I mean I tidied up my room slightly and then obviously I just had dinner really but yeah so as I said I'm gonna go and take my makeup off like I said I do really hope you enjoyed today's vlog guys if you did please smash a massive thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below if you haven't already but yeah until next time guys see ya